Hey YouTube friends, what I want to do like right now is cover a little bit about the magnetic tuning adjustments. And I've been reading a lot about it. I'll share, you, I'll share with you what I read, so it'll help you out. Uh, on this discriminator circuit here, we want to make sure is like when you're fixing the radio, is do what I did, measure these resistors, make sure you have symmetry in the resistors. Because this is, the circuit depends on the symmetry to operate properly. So, in my case, this has 2 meg and 2 meg on the schematic. Mine were 470k and 470k. If your radio has 2 meg and 2 meg, that's fine. Leave it. That's how they built it. And this has 1 meg and 1 meg. But whatever your symmetry is, if there's difference in the schematic versus what's in your radio, go with what's in your radio. But make sure you have symmetry. Measure the resistors and do like I did. Make sure they're like within 10% tolerance. And that's what I did. 10% tolerance. That should do it. Now, what I want to mention about the Philco adjustments for the uh, magnetic tuning do this real quick here. Let me shrink it down a little bit. There it is there. Spin it around. This is kind of like an IQ test this magnetic tuning circuit adjustment. Ever take an IQ test and it says like read all the instructions and then like the last instruction was like something like write your name and put the pen down you know and all the other kids are like doing it and standing on their head and doing all calling crazy things because they never read they never read the entire instructions. I remember that in grade school. Well this is like the same kind of thing Philco tells you all these things of how to do the adjustments. But you don't want to do all these right at the beginning because you'd be like really wasting your time. What you want to do is skip right down where it says frequency test and go to this part here where it says a further check on a magnetic tuning is very is a very carefully tuned to a broadcast station then turn the magnetic tuning switch from out to the in position. With a switch in either position, the tone of the station should not change. If a change in the tone or hiss develops, repeat the magnetic tuning adjustments, like up here. But, you don't even want to start doing those adjustments until you actually do this test first. So do that test first, and then what you want to do is do... Do that test first. And what you want to do is do this frequency test second, where it says a further check, second paragraph, further check on magnetic tuning is to very carefully tune a broadcast station and then tune the magnetic tuning switch from the out to the in position with a switch in either position. The tone should not change. Ah, that's not the one. I just read that one. You want to do sensitivity test part two. Now detune the signal first and above and then below the 1000 kilocycle mark to the point where the station is weakly heard. At each point, turn the magnetic tuning control on. When the control is turned on, the signal should return to normal output strength. If the magnetic tuning circuit does not pull the signal into resonance, the primary compensator 53A should be carefully readjusted. So to do the magnetic tuning adjustments, do this one first. This one here. I hope that's showing up okay. Just do that first. Do this one second. Check it out, you know, check it out these two but before you even do any of this uh, and when you rebuild the radio 
like I did with capacitors and out tolerance resistors. Make sure you got symmetry in those resistors that I showed you. And that's going to that'll save you really a lot, a lot, a lot of headaches. From what I've been reading. I must have got lucky because my, mine's working. I made little slight adjustments and uh, everything's good. I had to make a slight adjustment in 53A, which is this right here when I'm moving the when I'm moving the uh, the mouse here. This adjustment here, 53A. I made a slight adjustment to that, and the magnetic tuning works really perfectly now. So really happy with that. So that's what I wanted to mention about that, you know. So. Uh, Good luck when you when you do that magnetic tuning, and you could read uh, stuff on the Antique uh, Radio Forum. They have some information on that too. Take it easy, folks. Have a great day. Bye.